Melodyne Studio, MDD Editor, Custom Detection Settings. Hi, this is Carlo Libertini. In this demonstration, we'll take a quick look at one of my favorite advanced features in Melodyne Studio, how to create a custom detection preset based on our source material. Creating a custom analysis preset can help you work faster and more creatively. Let's check it out. What we're going to talk about now is the heart behind Melodyne's powerful analysis engine. You see, when you import audio or record audio, and then you want to begin editing it, well, thanks to Melodyne's analysis engine, we're able to have access to manipulating the audio like never before, thanks to its detection. Well, what a lot of people don't know is that this detection isn't a fixed value. You can customize the detection based on your source material. Now, why would you want to do that? Well, it's simple. In this demonstration, we'll take a look. Now, for demonstration purposes only, I've imported a vocal take on track one and a backbeat here on track two. Let's take a listen. Are you ready for the mission? Come on and show me your condition. Well, I can tell just by listening, obviously, that this vocal take is pretty melodic. I can see it, but more importantly, I can hear it. Let's open this vocal take in it, Melodyne's own unique editor. I'm going to double click on the track box like this. There. Now we can see the vocal take relative to its individual pitches and timing. Let's listen now. Are you ready for the mission? Come on and show me your condition. Now, what's visually being presented here is in accordance to how Melodyne applied its default detection algorithm in order to decide where to separate these notes into pitches and timing length. Here, I can see that by following this pitch line, why do we have these bizarre artifacts? What is going on here? Well, with a little experience, I can tell that Melodyne isn't picking up every note. And I can prove it simply by separating these notes individually. That note popped up there. That's a big jump. Here's another big difference. And another one. Well, why didn't Melodyne make these separations for us from the get-go? Well, it's simple, because we can actually increase the detection algorithm to make these separations for us, and I'll show you how to do that. Now, in this example, to increase the detection power of Melodyne, we're going to come up to Definition here in the menu and select Open MDD Editor. It will take our audio and import it in its own unique editor where we can customize how it's being presented to us. Now, if we remember back here, we see the anomalies with the pitch line where it actually missed detection with some of these note separations. We'll very easily come up to separation. I'm going to click in that box and watch as I increase the separation of value and let go these notes actually jumped to where I had manually edited them previously. So now I know that an increase to 115% from 100 gives us a better detection separation for this performance. And this will of course affect the entire performance. So now what we can do is I can bring this back down to 100 for example. There. And let me close this window. I won't save it. Rather, what I'll do is come up to Definition and choose Select Detection Parameter Now. Here, it gives us a preference window. I'm going to come up to Options and hit Add. And now I can name this new preset. I'll call it 115. And I'll take the separation sensitivity here. Remember? to 115% and I'll hit OK and there's our new detection parameter in the preferences. Let me close this window 
Now back up in definition, I'm going to re-detect the audio file and it wants to know, will you re-detect it at 1.15? I hit yes and watch. It's made those separations for us now. This is a quick and easy way with which to work faster and make Melodyne work for you. Now there are a lot more parameters with which to adjust in the editor and I suggest you experiment with them. This is just a quick way to gain access to how you can begin making Melodyne work for you and work faster, more creatively, and more fun. My name's Carlo and thanks for watching.